Hello and welcome to What The Hey, where I'm your regular host of What The Hey, and today in What The Hey, I am once again answering yet another question. When I go to my notebook of knowledge, I see the question of, what the hey are American mammoth donkeys? Now, I'm personally the one who asked this question because I heard about these animals and I was like, bruh, I gotta do some research, uh, so hello to me, um, and now it's time for the question. In terms of like a very basic description, American mammoth donkeys are a type of donkey that are essentially known for their size, hence the name. Now the reason why the American mammoth donkeys are so big is because of the line and history of like the breeding of the species and I'll kind of have a list of the different species that were kind of combined to make these donkeys. There's about five different species of other donkeys that were kind of put together to make the American Mammoth donkeys. And because of the different donkeys that were chosen, the American Mammoth donkey is like huge. In the words of Donald Trump, they're huge. Now, if you're curious, the whole reason why these American Mammoth donkeys are so huge is because the whole like method of making them big was so that the donkeys could do like really intense labor. So they're essentially working animals, basically. Now, depending on what part of the American Mammoth donkey species you're talking about, they have different names. Like the male donkeys are called Jacks and then the females are called Jennies, which I think that's fun. Now the largest recorded American mammoth donkey so far is named Romulus and he measures at like 68 inches, which is pretty heckin tall and big in general. In terms of like some general history, the breed was introduced specifically to the United States in 1785, so they've been around for a good bit. In terms of my general like opinion, American mammoth donkeys are so cool to me. I don't know why it is, but like any type of breed of animal that's like huge, just tall or just big in general is so impressive and it's just interesting because you know, like genetics. I mean like the frustrating part of that is, is when you think about like dogs and how like people in the past have like done breeding to where they've made like, you know, how some dogs can't breathe because their nose is so scrunched up into their face. But like with the American mammoth donkeys, there's not really any negative side effects to being huge. If I ever went into like a battle or a war and I had the chance to like pick what I could ride into battle on, it'd probably be an American Mammoth Donkey because they're just so cool. But that's essentially the answer to the question, so if you have any questions, let me know and I'll get to answering them as soon as I can, so thank you very much for watching. Bye!